In the previous episode, the Southern Empire failed multiple sieges and then lost land to Asurai. We started raiding caravans for huge influence gains, won several battles against Asurai nobles and caravans. Nobody wanted to vote for us to get a fief. We reached Clan Tier 5, which enabled the influence drain policy. We also spent 500 influence to burn Rigae's influence and abolish noble retinues. Now, I don't know where or which direction the, the caravans are going to go, so there's a caravan right there. Oh, this is a brand new one. It's got the exact units. Yeah, this is a brand new one, so they they must have just launched this one. <laughs> Probably from the ones that we killed. I wonder by killing all their caravans if it's affecting the economy much. Man, that's that's a pretty tightly packed mass. I don't Seems like we're pretty effectively dealing with it, but I'd rather get more accurate shots getting closer. Here we go. Alright, they're cavern coming and we're getting shot, so let's back out. Yeah, I'll probably end up just shooting the horses off on this one because they have a lot of troops. I don't really want to take much of a chance on this. This is going to be a tough battle, actually. Alright, we're not running into anything immediately. We can just take our time here. Oh, we are running into archers, though. Yep, 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 yep. I get it, I get it. It's going to be tough, because those... We're circling around the archers, which means they're going to be cutting off our escape every time we go, so... Let's get more of a linear path. All right, here we go. Man, their horses are really well ar armored. They're going to burn through our arrows. Might end up doing... Uh, killing some of the archers and trying to go for their, their quivers. That might have to be a thing here. I, I could switch... Could swap out for... Oh, crap. No, don't do it. For some reason, they slowed down. I don't know why, but... That saved us for sure. At least take out the weakly armored cab units. <clears throat> Alright, go for the leg. Right, we can hit some legs. Yeah, they've got seven, seven, six. They've still got a decent amount. It's it's gonna be tough. You know what though? We did drop some horse archers. We might be able to get we might be able to get a quiver or two from them. Actually, let's see if there's any here. I think they might have despawned already. Yeah, they despawn. Gotta love it. Freaking Bannerlord, man. Can't have too many assets on the map at once. Alright, we're... We're trying to end adventurer's careers here. In mass. That worked out really well. Unfortunately, none of them were archers. So, that doesn't help our... Ammunition situation, but... It's all good. Alright, what about their horse archers? Did they... Oh, you know what? Their horse archers ran out of ammo. That's why. Okay. But we did kill some earlier and they did despawn, which is unfortunate. There's nothing here we can get. Yeah, shields, swords, it's not going to help us. I mean, I can go around picking up individual ones. <laughs> oh, man. Be a cheap little scrounger. Look how many of these arrows are. Alright, well, let's... Um, I think we'll be okay. 45 arrows... They don't have any... Uh, yeah, they've got nothing mounted that... Alright, well. We gotta deal with the archers, obviously. Preferably without burning through all my arrows. There we go.
Why well, sometimes like when I let go of the the draw button, the arrow doesn't come out. It just like right there, it just happened again. I don't know if I'm trying to shoot it too fast. Maybe it's not ready yet. It's probably I'm not paying attention to my guy's animation, so maybe that's what's going on, but Yeah, I'm trying to like short chop it or whatever. Happen again. Yeah, maybe I'm trying to do it too fast. Alright, let's get these guys away. And then we're going to go in and grab a quiver before it disappears. There, 41. That's probably more than enough. So they actually have multiple caravan masters. Interesting, because this was a fresh spawn. That's four, five. So all five of their melee troops were uh, caravan masters. Alright, beautiful. That... Aside from that one shot, that was pretty good. 34 influence. Yeah, that's a good one. Let's see if they keep spawning that caravan again. Nope, here's another different caravan. But we don't want to fight it in the village. So we'll fight it here. Oops, I actually meant to trade with you first. Oh, he doesn't have money. Yeah, we've got too much loot now. Alright, we're going to need to focus on this one. Because this is going to be a tough battle. These are easy shots. I should not be missing. There we go. Alright, I think... Yep, yeah, they released their cab. Let's go for one more kill, and then we gotta go straight. There we go. And we gotta, we gotta peel off, because they're coming hard. Hot and heavy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not what I meant to do. This... <laughs> This horse goes so fast, I can't even control him. Crazy. Definitely rather, rather have it that way than being too slow, though. Right, we got a scoot. We're gonna get sliced. Yeah, we're gonna get sliced. Right, we gotta move. We don't have anything to lose. We'll try and get some of our gear back. Enemy cover coming, get it back. Oh, here we go again. My guy's going like half a mile an hour. I don't understand how these and these look at their, their horses don't even have armor. They're like low tier. And they're faster than me by a long shot. Now if we get grazed by a random straight arrow, which is probably going to happen at some point, uh, we're, we're just going to lose it again. But we got nothing to lose because we lost all our gear to these guys. So hopefully we can get our stuff back because I don't want to have to craft it again. Not that we've used it. Actually, it probably doesn't even matter. I haven't used any of the, the crafted stuff. Uh, horse armor, I tested it. It doesn't change the speed. It, it might have changed acceleration some, but not top speed. We need to deal with these archers because they're gonna. I, I just know he's gonna. He's gonna nail me. Yeah, I, I tested it out. Um, your your loadout that you have, and also whatever your horse is, is wearing. Oh, okay, right into the archers. Yeah, it doesn't affect your loadout and how much gear you have. Doesn't affect your horse. Um, as far as top speed, though, I now that I think about it, I don't think I tested for acceleration, so that that might be a thing. So we can't leave and come back. 
with a new loadout because we don't have enough hit points. So I think the best option here is just to shoot at range and hope that we have enough arrows to accurately hit them. I'm going to get up here where I can actually see. Yeah, 81 damage is rough, man. We need to do more than that. Yeah, I think the, the problem isn't so much the top speed, because we have a, a good top speed. The problem is the acceleration. Seems like it. maybe they have faster acceleration. I don't know. I don't know. Well, there's an arm trader down. Here we go. We're just knocking him in the head. What are these, 127 meters? That's not too bad. Yeah. All right, they're going to start shooting now. We're gonna run out of arrows. I can just sense it. All right, there's only nine left. I might try and circle them. It's it's gonna be hard. We're only 38 arrows left. We don't have the opportunity to come back in, so I don't know. We just have to take a risk, I guess. Once we deal with the archers, we can we can restock. All right, that's the last one. All right, let's get away from them. We'll go restock and then we're good. We'll, we'll assuming something stupid doesn't happen, which still worlds, I guess you never know. Um, we should be fine. Thirty-eight. Yeah, we should be good. Yeah, like I said, this this should have been a really easy battle. I mean, we came back in with, I don't know, a sliver of health and and did it. And we went into that last one with 80-something percent health. It sh that should not have happened, but I don't know. Maybe I I misjudged something. I just felt like we were moving fast enough to get away from them. And then they, next second I know we got two axes on two sides. So we got hit, like, from two different sides at the same time. That was pretty rough. All right, well, either way, we got we didn't get our stuff back, but we got... Retribution. We're at 1564. Yeah, I didn't have the issue with other caravans. This is like the 10th or whatever, 8 or 10th tenth caravan that I've done, and I haven't had an issue at all. With uh, Let's move ahead of this one. I want to fight this one, but not with 33 HP, so we'll try and pick on somebody else along the way. Let's see if we can heal up. Not a village, though, and not another caravan. There's nobody. Wow. No villagers, no looters, nothing. Uh, 25 is pretty reasonable. We can do that. Only 9 cav. Yeah, we lost our javelins. We have to go get more javelins. The other stuff's not as big of a deal, but we definitely need the javelins in case we don't finish. If we don't finish this fight, we're using looted gear. Alright, let's circle around these guys, try and get behind them. Only four of them. We should be able to handle it. So their calves should be coming out now. Yep, here they come. So we'll get a little bit of a head start. And I think I'm just not going to slow down as much. I just can't be. Even if it reduces accuracy, it's too much of a risk. Yeah, I don't want to get gang banged again. That was not a fun gang bang. <laughs> yeah, we'll just circle and take their horses out, I guess. Can I... Nope, they got a bit of turning radius. So let's... There we go. Alright. More conservative strategy. We should be good now. Oh, I shot straight through the ground. <laughs> I don't see anybody else. There should be another... There should be more cav. I thought I... Am I missing something? I don't think I downed all of them. Yeah, maybe I did. All right, let's circle in then. No, they're in there. I see what you're doing. They're uh, protecting the herd. Are we gaining another level? I, 
I think we need one more and then we'll have uh, another attribute point and then we'll put it into into vigor again. That should be good. It'd be funny if they hid one cab at the edge of the map and then he just comes and takes me out. <laughs> the old rope a dope. You think you're done and then they just come in and wipe you out in one hit. That'd actually be pretty smart if they hid cab and just brought him in randomly. All right, there we go. We don't want to. Oh, we ran out of food. That's right. So we do need to take something. Let's just take uh, the best boot food in the game. We'll take some butter. So level 39, yeah, one more level and we'll have another focus point. We can put that into Vigor. Man, I'm, I'm also tempted to put it into Charm though because Parade is pretty nice to have. Oh, we'll see. So 58, there should be a 50 strong caravan coming down this way. Oh, we can do this one then. 17 cab and 17 horse archers. Man, that sounds like a nightmare though. Uh, we have to, we have to. I don't want to, but we kind of have to. That's a lot of cav in this one, though. Okay, plan here is to get them away from their infantry and archers. And then we'll do the same thing. We'll just get behind them. All right, we're going to circle around them now. Oh, these are crossbows. So they won't have the same range, but if we get hit, it's going to hurt like hell. Alright, I gotta fix my aim here. What's going on? Got a scoot. They got some... Oh, they're coming. Yeah, they're coming. Let's just abandon that. I don't want to get stuck in that when the melee cav come. So we've got 85 shots. Unfortunately, we can't recycle any ammunition from those guys because it, it was all crossbowmen and we can't use the bolts. So I think on this one... What? I'm I'm going... I, I, was, I was pushing forward the whole time. I was going full speed. I don't know how they caught me so fast, and I had the freaking speed on, so I couldn't react. All right, well, let's just go back and heal. I gotta reset because I'm just not. I I don't I don't understand. I was I felt like I was moving forward the whole time, but they just like teleported and got right on top. Maybe I was hitting the wrong button. Or maybe I just wasn't paying attention. I was pushing left instead of forward. <laughs> oh man, Bannerlord problems, right? All right, let's uh let's reset with some grain. We'll buy, yeah, the javelins. We need a dumpy shield. I think it was this one that we were using. That's fine. It could be the RTS mod too. Yeah, maybe the speed up like did something to their their AI. I don't know. That that was really weird. I definitely didn't feel like we should have died there, but it's all right. Like I said, we we got our bow. I mean, that's the important thing. The other stuff's not that big of a deal. So I will sit here and do nothing for a couple days which is a total waste of time, and Rigae is catching up on her influence, but what can you do? So what does she have now? No, she actually spent a bunch of hers, so she's actually not doing too well. 9 and 10 sounds a little bit more reasonable, so we'll deal with these guys. All right, we got to get behind these guys. I think I hear the other cab coming soon. Yeah, 70 meters we gotta go. Oh, I'm not gonna use RTS because it's gonna get me killed. Wait till we're already at max speed. <laughs> that's so stupid. But, you know, that's mods. Guess I should have known better. 
So what I'm going to do here is circle around. Let's go through the trees. Try and get on their flank. Oh, they're not even gonna give me a shot, so I'll just go back on the uh, on the horse archers. Oh, all but one. All right, I think most of these guys, I'll probably just try and get on the flank like this and get them when they're exposed. That seems to be a pretty good way to do it. Here we go again. I was going too slow. That was my fault that time. There we go. All right. I think that's all the horse archers. Just a couple cav left. And then a bunch of archers. But the archers should be no big deal. Okay. It's not releasing when I do it. I would love to shoot my arrows on command. This is so obnoxious, dude. I, they're just, there's two left and they're just on me. They're just on me at all times. There we go. Can survive this one, I think. So 19 archers. Probably gonna do the circle. Yeah, that's a pretty big clump. It shouldn't be too hard. Uh around the trees though, this is not ideal. But it's hard to pass up. If I if I try and drag them somewhere else, they may spread out into a line or something. Which I don't want, so we'll just make do. Make do with the trees. Yeah, I'm trying to shoot too fast is what it is, I just noticed. I'm releasing it way too fast. I don't have it prepped yet. There we go. Okay, back in the wing column. 69 HP. Let's go grab some HP from these guys. Alright, nobody lives. I don't want anybody getting out. Oh, one guy got out. That's alright. There's a lot of good caravan targets here. 35. No, that's right. Oh, yeah, it's because we lost all our stuff. Yeah, I remember now. Archers are right near. Yeah, we gotta get it. We gotta get out. Oh, I got that. I got that horse archer. Barely got him in the. I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. That was a joke. Oh, they're like not even moving. Look at that. They're crawling. Well, sometimes you just get lucky. Sometimes Bannerlord gives you a, a free ride. Yeah, I probably should have been dead there, hitting that tree. But thank you, Tailworlds. Alright, that's dealt with. Let's deal with the archers first. Especially these... These crossbow ladies. Oh, man. He bent down to reload and I hit her in the top of the head. That's like... Ultimate headshot. And I just got nailed. Alright, that did 22 damage. Alright, there goes the crossbow. These guys shouldn't do as much damage. Nope, there's another crossbow. Or there was was a crossbow. Not anymore. There it goes. 
I gotta adjust when I get close. I keep forgetting to adjust when I get close and uh, not aim close enough. I'm so used to going at like top speed and I gotta aim like three or two horse lengths ahead of him or behind him to actually hit him. No, ahead. Yeah, I said that right. And last one I don't want to fiddle with his shield, so we'll just let him attack. So I don't think we're going to catch that guy, but we can definitely catch this one. Yeah, melee combat's a lot... Wait, did I see that right? Yeah. <laughs> he, like, popped into the floor. But yeah, I was saying melee combat's way better now. Hand over your goods. So only 10 cab this time. There's one. Oh man, got him. That was a lucky shot. All right, here comes the calf, the real calf. Yeah. Let's go through the woods. Oh, these guys are cutting me off. Yeah, the AI is a lot smarter about cutting you off too. They'll, well, I don't wanna say smarter. They just, I guess they copy your move exactly. So, that's a thing. That didn't kill, wow. That's a shame. Man, I hit him good there too. Alright, let's take horses out then. I don't want to play with these guys and make a mistake. Alright, there's more horses down. Oh, right in the foot. All right, we got him. And we do have... Oh, it's one of where the archers are. They're over there. Uh, let's... Let's deal with a couple of these guys first. See if we can stay out of range of the archers. Just clean up the field a bit so I don't have to accidentally run into somebody later. Oh, this guy's throwing. Got him. All right, archers are here. And they're in the woods. I can circle around it. It's a small patch of woods. They're pretty safe about that. Oh, yeah. Get out of here. Get out of here, crossbows. Yeah, we can take an arrow or two from these little dinky guys, but not the crossbowmen. Oh, they scare me so much, man. All right, I'm going to take my time on this one. Nope. There's one crossbow down. Got him. There we go. All right. Crossbow. I think there's one more. Yeah, there's a sword lady there. She's dead now. Good Ladrail does not care. Well, she is an elf. She should be pretty good at archery, I'm assuming. I guess it would have been cursed if I did, if I did cro- oh, Come on, game. Come on. Don't start hitting me now. If, uh, it would have been funny if I did crossbow instead of archery, instead of bow. Oh, we would just want a big battle somewhere. We're, we're winning battles, but not taking beefs. Oh, wow. They took Melian, too. That was owned by Regea, so she owns only one fief now. This is perfect. All right, let's heal up a little bit. Heal off of these guys. Five influence and we'll get, yeah, 10% health more. Here's another small caravan. We're making quite a bit of money here too, which we might need actually. We got some calf coming. They only have two of them, though. Three. They have three.
Yeah. And you're toast. All right, that's it. So no more cav. Can I put an arrow in your face? There we go. And that was pretty easy, actually. It's another small caravan. Ooh, I did not mean to walk past you. Wow, 99. He took it like a champ. I cannot hit this guy, man. What is... I hit him once for 99. There we go. All right, now he's gone. So, seven cab. We should be able to handle these pretty easily. They look unarmored, so we'll just do the same thing. hit the rock. Oh yeah, I was going to say, I'm pretty sure those infantry are coming soon. Oh, that would have been cool if I hit him midair. <laughs> His horse got airborne. That would have been pretty cool if I took him out. Alright, the, yeah, the cat can wait. That's not a big deal. Let's start circling around these infantry, or these uh, archers. wider oh man that hurt yeah that hurt luckily it wasn't a crossbow though I feel like my aim's worse when it's a slow, easy shot. <laughs> I think I, I had that problem when I played a lot of sports too, like, especially basketball. I was terrible at basketball. I was good at defense. I couldn't shoot for crap, man. I would miss layups all the time. <laughs> like, the easier the shot was, the more often I was gonna, gonna miss. Same thing with these archery shots. I don't know if my brain just gets lazy and and looks for like a shortcut and you can't you shouldn't like the shortcut is actually worse than just doing it normal <laughs> uh, let's actually follow this guy and do it during the day i don't want to fight this at night and then we don't have other targets to attack anyway so it doesn't really we don't lose anything yeah now we can actually see what's going on all right let's draw these guys out and that way we'll have some time between the infantry and the other melee cav and we can some cover here from this little hill Okay, this is not a good start, boys. Oh my god, this is horrible, man. We go from not getting hit like three raids in a row to just... We kill one guy and take three hits. Are these guys just that much better? Am I doing something wrong? Let me reset here and try and... not hit my shots that's what it is and they got a, they have a lot of people here 
There we go. All right, they still have their cav back there, so we have time. Yeah, we just gotta whittle them down. They have, I think, what it is is they have that critical mass, where they're they're just gonna nail you. Yeah, I need. Oh yeah, yeah, that's that's fun. I'm debating if I want to just back out and give up on this one because I don't want to die. I really don't want to go down again, but. I think it's worth it to just keep trying. We got a lot of them down, more than half. Yeah, I think I need a different tactic for when they have... Hey, okay, move, move horse, move horse, move, 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 move. Jeez, I'm just gonna go. I, I don't even wanna deal with it right now, to be honest. Yeah, we attack them so we can back out. Yeah, uh, I don't wanna die. So, restart again. Let's go heal. I think that was the right call. It just sucks. We have to wait, waste days and days to do this. All right, so Newcastle, that might actually go to us. Yeah, it does. And there's a peace deal, which means we can immediately sue for peace. So we got Melian Castle. We got this one, which is pretty good. It's, it's kind of safe. It's a little tucked away. Let's go back up there. We have nothing much to do now that there's no war. So we're going to take the garrison going to get rid of all this put it on festival and games and let's go donate these prisoner or these troops to someone else so we can get some influence for it oh somebody just recruited a bunch 13 that's pretty good there you go what do we need to do probably craft our weapons back so we need to go find some Pugio. all right what is she at she's yeah they've got no influence at all man we i'm tempted to try but i think we need more i don't want to get to the point where we we go through it and then we just don't have enough Oh, I already have javelins. Yeah, why did I do that? Uh, we need to find Pugio. Onir is being sieged. Interesting. So I bet you uh, the Kazate are probably doing that. Yeah, like right now is the perfect time to have enough influence to do to pull this off, but we just don't. We just don't. We need more. Nobody's got Pugio. Yeah, we, we got no other choice. We have to we have to keep the influence coming. All right, no big deal. Yeah, six influence is kind of a waste of time. Really got to get that. Thing back online. Get, uh, get back to war. Stop right there. Stop right there. Only four. Wow. Guess not. But we're at 1700. That's pretty close to where we need uh, to, to be. I think maybe 2500. I was going to say three, but I think maybe 2500. Assuming they don't have a ton of influence to spend. All right. We got some Pugio. We don't need a lot of them, but we probably need like six. Actually, let's just keep heading up this way. We're already kind of heading up here anyways. Oh, snow. The other thing I want to do is check and see where... So we're at war with Elefteroi, Ember of Flames, and Hidden Hand. So we could pay a visit. Yeah, of... Oh, they might be... Actually, they might be prisoners. Yeah, they're prisoners. So that doesn't help. Wait, who is not a prisoner? Agalmon, which is up in the north. And Kavol, which is up in the north. Could head up there. Yeah, let's, let's go Epicrodia next. Oh, wow. Look at that. Uh, let's not buy all the Pugio because we're probably end up wasting a lot of them and the AI is not going to buy it. So we just don't need that much. And that was stupid. I didn't mean to use all of it. All right, let's save a couple so that we can actually make what we need to make. So we need to make a one-handed. I probably need to smelt these two, don't I? Oh, wow. We need more. Okay. I think if I recall, the pole arm that we use also uses three. So I think this is what we need. One-handed folks, and then the pole arm, biggest dickus. Yeah, three, perfect. So we got exactly what we need, and we got a legendary man. We and a masterworks. We better not lose these. That's gonna be kind of annoying. Yeah, pressure's on now. These are good swords, uh, good weapons. I mean, 103 cut damage for one-handed is quite good, and then the biggest dickus with 40 pierce damage. That's a lot. I think the best you can do is like 42, before you get bonuses but not at 300 length. So this is pretty good. So there's one here around Agalmon. Oh, nope, he, they changed. Yep, they're, uh, now we're not at war with them anymore now. Uh, says there were still enemies, but, uh, that's broken. Yeah, that's definitely not accurate. Oh, well. Titania, Hidden Hand. Oh, okay, I see what it is. This guy's, okay, so this guy's not at war with anybody. That is Kazate. 
These are all Kazate. So let me mark these out. We'll go check them out. Well, I know where Tile is. I know where Ortengard is as well. Okay, so let's head up there. Ortengard, Tile. So basically up here, anywhere up here is fine. We'll probably just see what's fastest. Okay, so that is over here in the top, in the northeast. Yeah, Kaisar Castle. Okay, so they, it looks like they're moving that way. Keep an eye out for them. There's one. All right, we got him. But let's not do it in the village or at nighttime. And it's mostly... What do you got? Mostly calf, but unshielded calf, so we can just use our, our bow and arrow. Man, this snow is brutal. Look at how weak these attacks are. These should be one shot in everybody. We have to hit them twice. Yeah, this is this is pretty rough. All right, I think if we s stay a little closer, seems like it's okay. They do have. Uh, uh, actually, it looks like they're just infantry. That's fine. They do have throwing weapons though, so you got to be kind of careful. Yep, our horse just got hit in the face. Yeah, I feel like I'm shooting javelins right now. These things are so... The drop-off is pretty crazy. Go. Yeah, unfortunately they only had 28 units. I don't think we're going to get a ton of XP for, or uh, influence for this, but... I mean, it's better than fighting bandits, to be honest. Should be more. <laughs> I thought he was going to get unstuck. I tried to lead him a little bit. All right, there we go. All right, that's it. That's the battle. There we go. All right, we'll take him. We should... Yeah, we'll we'll donate these guys. Actually, I might need to give them up because we're, we're hunting for more people up here before we go back down. Yeah, it's not worth it. We're only going to get a couple influence from these guys. Let's just dump them. That was... It's all right. So... Biznar. So it looks like he's moving that way, but that's a recent mark, so we should be able to catch him. Yep, there he is. Only 14. No, he's broke. He's broke. It's been a while. 13 calves, so this should be easy. Ooh, that guy came out fast. Now, it said they have one infantry. I don't know what kind of infantry. I don't even see him. Are they retreating? They're running already. Cowards. Put the arrow in your body and then let it go. <laughs> yeah, imagine if somebody stabbed you with an arrow and then drew it back from a bow and let it go. That's basically what we just did to that guy. Nine influence. We'll take it. And the other two, I think, were already in jail. Decrease range damage. Yeah, we'll try it out. 39. And we got 125 scouting finally. Now this one, yeah, track duration and, and movement speed. The movement speed is usually what I take, but we're going to go spotting distance. Just because it'll help us quite a bit. Alright, I don't want to stop and wait for that. Rebels and Onira. Oh, they lost it. Not It's not going to help us though, because we can't leave the kingdom. And we're not at war with them. Oh, uh, we need to... Yeah, we need to donate. I Just go to this one. So two lords for 12. That's fine. She's still below 200. But yeah, she's she's hosed, man. Uh, I don't want to share. Alright, who else are we at war with that we can actually attack? So they're Sturgeon, they're Batanian. It's just the LF Thedoi. They're very poor. They're not going to have troops, though. Yeah, they're going to be broke. Uh, I need a second to think. I'm, I'm trying to think if it's worth it to declare war on somebody or just let it happen. Danustica? Wait, what are they doing down here? They came way down here. Wow. Well, I know who we're joining next. Hmm. Actually, who are we about to go to war with? 10% there. Nobody. Nobody wants war with anybody. I Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. I mean, the only thing we can really do is is move around and take out hideouts you know let's let's go do hideouts and we're going to use the melee skill uh, the melee equipment that we have i think that's probably the best use is to just get some melee skill at least some xp and then we'll also be at the same time get a little bit of uh, influence so we'll go shield and our nasty falcs
173, that's much better than what we were doing last time. 155, pretty good. He's faster than me. Okay, I had my shield up. Hold it. Hold it and smash him. Come on. Come on. <laughs> that would have totally chopped his leg off. Oh, good block. So nine influence is actually not bad and we're getting uh these are not worth you know we can take them with us because we could just not take them into the the hideout and then we'll go donate them later like i said we can't lead troops in battle but it doesn't mean we can't have them in our party from time to time just to to get influence so that's fine we can do that and we'll take a little bit extra food they don't oh they do have butter yeah we need we need more butter for sure All right, you're not allowed to come in oh you know what? i actually have a perk yep let's take the perk and neither of them are important because we're not using troops. You coward! Yeah! Watch out so we don't get shot. Wow, he's, he's attack canceling too. Nice. Like I said, the AI is way better at melee now. Like, significantly better. Well, okay. That doesn't make my case, but I guess you take my words. <laughs> they are much better. On average. How about that? Oh, this is not good. There we go. Actually, I can do it here. I'll show you. Oh, he didn't walk into it. Oh, he actually didn't block in time. Vast majority of times I've done it. I've done it in tournaments against like even low tier, and they they recover in time to block. Okay. Try it against one of these guys, maybe. I want to kick you. Let me kick you. <laughs> no, he's managing distance really well. I can't get him. Uh, anyways. Yeah, it's it's definitely harder. Maybe it's because the guys, whoever I kicked had a high um, athletic skill or something, but I definitely could not get past his guard. There we go. What are we at anyways 200 so we hit 200 that's pretty fast get him before he stands up oh, get out of here <laughs> no rest for you you you've got quite a <laughs> good block ai oh man well sometimes the ai is really good look at that we're collecting a lot of troops here we just need to make sure we have uh, we can take some prisoners too we need to have enough food to feed these these mongrels a lot of butter, a lot of cheese, a lot of Pepto-Bismol. Now this one, movement speed or damage to your shield. That's a tough one. 
I don't feel like the damage to the shield's that important. There's there's not too many times where we're gonna need to have a shield survive. So I think movement speed's probably the pick. And 10% is like whatever. You know, if it survives 20 shot or 20 hits, now it's gonna survive 22. Like who cares? Uh what else can we do? We could do this hideout up here. There's some more over there. It's kind of far. I think maybe this mountain bandit. Or we can come up here, hit the sea raider. So let's do oh nice, we got it just in time. Alright. You are not allowed. There we go. Ah, uh, there's the Falks. That's what I was waiting for. There we go. All right. If I had my two-hander, I'd probably be trying to chamber block these guys because they're attacking kind of slow. <laughs> oh, look at he's twitching. Bump, 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 bump. Nice. Yeah, this guy's by himself. We should. Oh no, he's not. Oh, there's a lot. All right. Get rid of the shield if I'm gonna try and kick. Should be able to bust this guy's shield though. There we go. I'll try to. I'll try some feints and see if that helps, but it doesn't seem like it does. Like, they switch, no problem. Yeah, I did it three times there, and they just blew past it. The kick, I don't know if they mess with the kick range, too, but it, if, it feels like... Yeah, see, look at that. The kick, that before, pa the, before this patch, there's no way that would have happened before. You would have easily just gotten around it. That's part of the shield. They definitely changed the kick for the worse. I'm starting to lose a little bit too much health. Let's just speed it up. Yeah, I... One thing, it's interesting, so the combat's a little bit more, I guess I would say, predictable. Because you you kind of know what, what you can do and what you can't do, and a lot of stuff you can't even use anymore. It's just kind of pointless. So it's definitely harder, and I, I do like that the AI actually blocks and, and attacks at a reasonable rate. Right, let's actually get this guy. Oh, his leg's stuck. There we go. Yeah, this guy's a lot faster attack, so I can't get two attacks in for everyone. Oh, wow. Well, we can just smash him, though. Uh, let's stop here and sell some stuff. We still have food. Yeah, we got enough food. So this actually worked out pretty well. This is going to be a good way to get influence, I think. I guess we'll see, but we got a, we got a pretty healthy amount of troops here that we can donate. Let's go get him. <laughs> Imagine some psychopath jumping down the hill and just slashes your guts open. I don't think we missed anybody. Man, we busted through that guy's shield so fast. And this is only one-hander. If we had the two-hander, it'd be even faster. Oh, no legs for you. I bet you, I, I'm pretty sure the Falks in real life does dismember. So I could just imagine this thing, maybe not two legs, but at least one leg. It probably just sliced through one leg. Ooh, that took a big chunk of our health.
Man, that hurt. 40 damage. All right, where is he? Am I blind? Uh, did I miss one? I think I missed one. Damn, man, that sucks. All right, can we see him with... I still have my bow and arrow. I don't know where the map, like, cuts off or anything, but can we see him from here? Yeah, there's still a brigand somewhere. I should have looked a little closer. All right, hopefully it's not too far. Uh, I wish there was a yell button like in Project Zomboid. <laughs> Just start yelling. Where are you? Oh, this is annoying. And we don't have we don't have troops, so we can't just F1, F3 to heat seek and find them. Nope, this is the beginning of the map. Where the heck is this guy? All right, this is such a waste of time. Where the hell is this guy? Oh, here he is. Yep, I knew it. But you're not going to get up in time, so at least we don't have to fight him. That's how good Ladriel fights. Reminds me of that training scene. Uh, she, she just taking on like 10 people at once. Effortlessly, I might add. Uh, I want to fight these guys, but I can't because we've got troops that I can't... Um, I can't just like get rid of them. Okay, Charm 200. This one doesn't really make a difference. Yeah, we can't use the governor. We don't have companions. We're not convincing anybody of anything, so... Uh, whatever. Yeah, that's a throwaway one, but that's alright. So troops, how much we got? 11, that's it? Whoa, that is nothing, man. You guys are cheap bastards. <laughs> that is so bad. Wow. And did we have... I think we didn't have all the hardwood. Let's get rid of the hardwood, the charcoal. Yeah, we got too much butter now. We're just going to go back to the grain. Grain diet. And what else do we have? Uh, I don't want to commit to either one. The only skills we'll be doing is engineering and medicine. Everything else is useless for what we're doing. I have a feeling it's going to go engineering, but I might actually put it in medicine because at some point we'll eventually get up here. So 175 helps you. It helps reduce death chance. And then 225, if we put a focus point when we hit 40, we could do that and hit. But, it, but getting up here is going to be really hard just because it's so hard to, to level. So I don't know. Oh yeah, prisoners. We can donate. It's probably worth nothing. One influence. Come on. So we got 12 influence from that, plus whatever we got from doing all that stuff. What are we gonna do now? Yeah, we we took out like four hideouts. And that just really slow. Yeah, look at that. She's catching up. She was at 180. She gained 40 in the time that we gained, probably about about that much. Alright, are we more likely to go to war with somebody? No, man, we're not at war with anybody. What the heck? Well, I don't want to be in the snow because it's really slow, so let's go somewhere else. Uh, we should probably go hunt down the clans. It's just LF Thedoi. Berenia Castle, Kesar. So they're still over there. Half of them are captured. Odok. Are they at war? No, they're not at war. So if he's in Odok, he's not in jail. So let's just head up there, I guess. And then we'll see if we can find more bandit hideouts. 